Sniper mid. Wow. I, I mean, I, I don't think I've seen a lot of snipers popping off. As we hit the five minute mark and is going to try and make a play here. Ame, is he going to overextend slightly? Can they bring him down in time? Oh, KJ instead is going for the Chen. Okay. There's the connection, and DY is going to go down instead. <laughs> That's actually first blood. It's the last hit. <laughs> they wanted to give Night Stalker the last hit, but Night Stalker. They're going. They want to. XM. We should find him here. Chased. Go. Catches him with the root. The clap is there. And XM is going to go down to this. Analog is taking trade, a lot maybe. of damage. Does have a fairy fire. Hanging on to it. Trying to bait ZinQ to come in a little closer. And will instead turn now onto Skullfield. Does more damage. He's gone. ZinQ, can he clean up this Enchantress? Uh, with Nature's Attendance and a Healing Lotus. Not looking like KJ is kind of just chilling too. But they're hoping to find somebody here. And DY is going to be the one that they find. Off to the side. And eventually we'll get him with the trample. And, well, has Onslaught after. Not going to go for Ame, though. Use it for very much anyway. It would be nice right now. But that's a cool down. Oh, they know Divine Llama doesn't have any TP help, though. And never mind, he just turns and pops ulti and doesn't need it. Now Chrono trying to kill him. Do they have enough to bring down this no, Night no, Stalker? No. Yes, they will. So that's one thing the Bruel did give them is no TPs to help the Night Stalker. Yeah, no, that's really good. Good read. If that's just good game reading there. And of course, they also force the Night Stalker ult in the daytime. So now they know for a fact he will not be useful and keeping right back into that middle lane to get a double kill for the sniper here. It helps yeah. with trading in the laning stage. It's 20% evasion is just quite a lot, honestly, as he leaves a tier one token on the ground there. Hector, what are you doing? Oh, man. I mean, it's it's oh. kind of weird. It kind of happens, but we'll see. The bat rider. Thank you. Yeah, right there on him. <laughs> so dead. Yeah, no chance to get away from that one. And it's just kind of like annoying because this happens sometimes like in and going and right on top of them xm no way they don't decide to go all the way in does he have blade mill oh he already Not used enough. it and xm manages to survive to violama goes down to two? two? Oh no so i'm playing versus a brewmaster sniper and a faceless void all three of these heroes just want to farm you All right, force out dead. the rule. It's time to go. Surely. Surely. Yeah. <laughs> he's uh, he's mega dead. <laughs> DY looking to be in some trouble as well. Pulverize comes out. They have the Radiant he's online. <laughs> he's fine too. Yeah. Good job. You expected daylight to protect uh, Primal's so silly when he gets like surged or hasted. They don't have any ground stuns other than Chronosphere, so he should be able to do that every single time. Like that they do have a lot of ground AoE damage. KJ, he is dead. Has healing Lotus, but not going to be enough to make a difference. Divai Llama thinking about chasing. Actually, uh, have more heroes in the area early. All right, they're bringing in the Life Stealer. Divai Llama taking some damage, but now <laughs> she took over. <laughs> the life stealer infested creep. Right, still going, and Zinq is in no man land. He gets brought down too. Shin creeps. It just keeps you mana, so you can keep spamming spells. I can see the logic behind this build. I've just never seen it before. As they're gonna go and bottom. Oh, bro. the root, on Ame, but he got hit. Oh, nicely played by heroic to catch Ame. That's Chrono used too. Radiant are scanning. Damn. Big Ame having a bit of a rough game here. His network progression for 17 minutes is not good. No. He is, oh no. Again, Divai Lama will go down. I mean, Exum is doing his best here to try and make stuff happen on the map. He did go for a Maelstrom. So I'll top some play this the other time, and he went for like the Shadow Blade type of build. Five ability, but he's going straight damage on XM. He's yet another kill here provided with the help of the sniper, so I did analog invis. Hello, how are you, Zinq? Atos? Ooh, to interrupt the onslaught. So I guess that he didn't time that perfectly, but doesn't matter. Oh, maybe it does matter. 
work it out for Max XS. Schofield now in trouble. Schofield now dead. Dyer's top tower is under attack. HP. It always surprises me every time when I click on Sniper, see how tanky he is. Oh, it's Gen Q. They might bounce. Uh, still taking oh. a lot of damage. He's got Blade Mill. Here goes out. And yeah, Analog is living. KJ taking some damage, but trying to get away. No way. Analog just dropping the mech in the last second. And Analog is going to fall, but can they clean up a little more? Zinku goes down to Divai Lama. The Bruce split used. Hector wanting to chase onto the Chen, finds him, kills him. Does have an escape route still with that infest if he wants it. Faceless Void tries to run away. These Bruce splits gonna wear off soon. XM already with the triple kill. Trying to run away from Sniper. Not sure how well that's gonna work for you. Divai Lama caught for the moment. Infest to get away. <laughs> oh, Divai Lama running. Trying to get out of there. Dark Ascension only has a little bit of time oh, the Chen courier. with the Chen Courier. But now his nighttime is about to be taken away from him. Oh, he eats up the creep to heal back up. Now the turn, he's back onto him. XM, TP away on one, he gets out of there. But Hector, no he might be on that trouble. No oh, he's going to get brought down as nah, he tries trapped. to escape. Manta has another rage soon. And yeah, you're right. He does manage to escape from there. Wow, that was crazy. I don't have enough lock down there. I'm not able to get the perma bash there, but... And that started off with a, I would say, a very undesirable chrono as they're gonna smoke out immediately. Whoa. Okay. Uh, so out. We're gonna get KJ, get a freebie. I think they wanted a higher target, and like the Night Stalker and Ultimate. They did but... get the Bruce split. Analog thinking about going. They're just defending this ward of theirs. And Heroic, at the moment at least, standing their ground, not wanting to let them leave, but also not initiating yet. Ooh, terrorized. Only hit onto one, and there's the lift up. Primal Beast is lifted and the Life Stealer is lifted inside of him. They need to get in there. Chrono on to that Night Stalker. Can they bring down the Sniper? Can they bring down anybody? Nobody is being found. They try and take him down. Now hitting immediately onto XM. BKB wearing low, surrounded by three heroes and going to be killed off. Rue now also in No Man's Land. XXS tries to TP away. Onslaught to break it. The Atos there as well. That ends up being two for one is extreme. He's just fast. stuck around a little bit too He's long. Real unless, <laughs> unless He's real fast. Unless Brew trying to get out. <laughs> he actually will. All right, never mind. Well, the side of extreme is a little bit more separated. Radiant uh, are scanning. You want to get the side soccer old. Ooh, setting to creep up. They see one. The They're sniper. gonna find him. They want to go on Sniper or Ame. Ame, he got rooted for a moment. Pops the Chrono, only hits onto Schofield. That's not good enough. XM is in trouble. Hand of God trying to kill him off, but the Life Stealer did enough damage that the rest of the team could clean up after the fact. They find more. Ame is in trouble. For the moment, Ame is in a ton of trouble. He too is gonna die, and K1 keeps finding another. DY will TP out, but that is a huge win. Three for one, thinking about chasing? Has Blink Dagger ready, but won't go for it. Yeah, that was big, and unfortunately for Ame, they, they are this is Ame. Why we saw... Oh... Uh, Blink Dagger. Yes, Blink. He gets him. Ooh, Orchid from XXS. Will it be enough? Thought about it. Terrorize goes out. Ame jumped in, but then walked away. DY here. Double, DY dead. He goes for it. He barely. Oh, no. no, it could have been big. And Divai Lama gives him the tip after the fact. It is still analog trying to back out. Gets hit by that sniper. Divai Lama thinking about jumping onto XM. Finds him. And with Hector inside, that'll be enough to take down the sniper. Ame tries to back away. Analog is on him. Pulverize is there. They have the silence to follow it up after. Dead Ame. Holy moly. What a freaking combo. Okay, they still got him. Now, as XXS next on the docket, he too is going to be brought down. Aaron Devai decides not to. Zinq is still nearby. Has the life stealer inside of him. Jump in. Find one lasso onto Schofield. Things would catch up with me. They're not willing to go for anything else. 77% physical resist he's working with. But there is a lot of magic damage. It's a lot of magic damage. Okay, fair.
<laughs> so what you're saying is they have to catch him when he's not raged. Uh, Schofield again? Yeah. It's down. I mean, Schofield's like the king of just being in your face. For better or worse, yeah. he's going to be in your face. You know? I'll never expect that we'll fight without Schofield. Does that buyback? Ame on the creep wave. DY nearby. Do they decide to go on him? Do they decide to go on somebody else? Jump forward, find one, bashed by Roach, killed by the team. Now jumps together, Chrono onto all of them. Is it enough to take down Hector though? He's living, does not have Infest anymore. Turns, wants to run away. Ame still thinking about the chase. Dead. Finds the bash, finds the kill. Buyback from two. The rest of the team is dying though. Hector, K1, KJ in disguise, excuse me. Enchantress is the real carry here. Destroyed. That faceless void and now looking for more. They buy back, but they didn't even need it. They won that fight handedly. Four dead, now looking for a fifth as the Earth Panda is eventually gonna get chased down here. They are running. That's like the Oh, he wasted his pulverize there. Oh yeah. Root okay, does not really matter. Oh he got Oh does it? Wait a minute, okay. Uh, splits out and lives, and yeah, they have to leave. Now nobody is. Life Seal Illusion's going into the base. They it should realize, the hey, there's carry. nobody here. Oh, KJ caught for a moment. Jump in, silence, finding and trying to kill off that Chen. And well, Divine Llama is just gone. That's Chrono down, but a big win for them there. Jay tries to back away. Zing Q moving in is going to find that lasso. Doesn't use it as of yet. Hector shows up. Now turns onto the Batrider. Abyssal Blade control. Batrider in trouble getting healed back up. It's not enough heal though. And fast now into the primal to reset this fight. Backing away is Schofield. They have lost both supports after that Dark Willow dies. What? Lost on the map and extreme. I mean, they do take a ton of damage. Uh, back really have anything now there for life. Though. Faceless Void. True. Jump in. Abyssal. Okay. Pulverize. Oh, but they pull him back out with the tornado. What? How? Hurricane. The hurricane worked, that worked? apparently. Does that break Pulverize? It did. I, I, I'm i mad right now. Final and heroic. <laughs> what? Dude, the most value Wild Wing Ripper. Gank this creep. It's too strong. Damn. Or Staff Hurricane Pike? I don't know. Like. Well, I'll have to go back and look at it. They're going to try again. Abyssal trying to take down Ame. Do they have enough? He's down to half HP, but he's living. Jumps back forward. Yeah, and Chrono now the three starts to die. Chrono almost ready. Analog there. Do they have enough to kill off Ame? They need a few more hits, but he gets away again. Now it is Life Stealer. Divine Llama on top of him. Wait a minute. The silence. The rock throw. No, Ame drops the Chrono down. XM turns to hit. And now K1 hitting onto the sniper. Try to got into rooted damage. Another time walk away. Living. Range creep chasing. Wanting to find somebody. Can they kill him off at all? Do they have enough damage to take down XM? They do. Hector now turns. Oh, no, Ame kills him also. Schofield with the double kill. This man died 13 times, but he got the kill when it mattered most. Both dead without buyback. My yeah, there's no buyback on either of these heroes. And do they have it? Soon? Oh my god. No. And no. No. For Neither. gold. Oh, wow. What a timing. And they find the Bat Rider on the side of the map. Yeah. Rock throw. Stun there on to one. The rest of the team is nearby. Fear for the moment. Lift up with the Wind Waker. Life Stealer's inside. Life Stealer is in no man's land. He doesn't have rage right now at best. He's caught for the moment. Put the E-Blade. E -blade. Oh, Schofield, what a save. KJ off to the side. Now the connection. They catch onto that sniper and getting whittled away by this Enchantress. So much damage coming from the inch. They try and do more to her, but they can't. He can't stop KJ. The hits are in. K1 on to DY. Takes him down low and going to take him out of this fight. Now, Sniper did buy back. He's up on the high ground. Blinking away at folks, but they don't really have the good lockdown anymore. No more Chrono available. Divine Llama backs away, tries to go in and out on Ame, but can't do that much more. What an E-Blade save for the wind as they back away on XM. But now Ame, he's going to be caught. They do have Lasto back up in 10 seconds, but it's going to be too late. As Ame has died, no buyback for him. Nullifier on to Zing Q. They have kited this fight perfectly. And Heroic, they are going to be rewarded.
Can they do anything with poor old XM? The sniper trying to plink away from far away. There is not that much left in the tank for him. The Ancient is exposed. They move on forward. They're going to start to take it down. KJ, the man of the hour. He's just hitting the throne himself. The Hurl Boulder, the Pulverize. Gets a lift up there. But K1, he's had enough of these shenanigans. He's going to start hitting the throne too. The Sniper is dead. Game one goes to Heroic. Rubik Caudal lane sounds like the most meme lane of all. So a bit of a bold pick here by L. Oh my God, is he gonna, are they gonna get three here? I think so, or Hector might die. The battle begins. Uh oh, has to skill Doppelganger. Gets up to the high ground. Oh, <gasps> the shards! Oh, God's rebuke. Blinding light pushback. Excuse me, not blinding light. Uh, flame break. <laughs> they get the kill. I oh, they have the same here. thing. Oh, yeah, that's a really good shard thing. And again, very casual, chill type of game. Uh, analog is oh, actually back. pulled a wave. And yeah, do they get anything? Enough. On to KJ. And does have healing Lotus if he wants to use uh, it. Shield smash him. No. That's what that spell's called, right? Shield smash. We got a that's Rubik what, uh, running in here. Schofield will not let you get away with this one. Uh, I don't know. That was interesting. I mean, he can... I think they got him. Oh no, Gyro's. Yeah, Gyro's here too. I think the two supports. He's got a second blood grenade that missed, by the way. What is happening? Why did XM go through? I guess he was like. A third blood grenade has been used on XM. Dude. They want him. What they want him bad. What the hell is this? <laughs> They're like, you're not getting away with this one, buddy. That's oh, crazy. Man. He just All ran under tower. Things are not feeling great here for Analog. Tusk is being very annoying to him. Gotta be careful. XM. They are Get going on board. Hector. Although KJ now throws out the spear by XXS. They're TPing in the primal. Missile is going to land. Oh, Onslaught got interrupted though. It doesn't matter. Still have enough for the kill. Good movement by Heroic. If we're going for that rotation. And there's a big stack if that Ami is going to end up doing. Ooh. Stacking as well. Seven minute wisdom rooms. Schofield. Schofield. We'll get it. <laughs> and gonna try and deny himself. We'll see if he manages to do just that. Do, do, do. Zinq gets it. A good attempt. But nope. Smoke him up with Schofield. He's thinking about it. Yep, there it is. We're gonna buy go bottom right away here. Tries to get out, does get some separation with the onslaught, and now he's sniper. XM got a high Horse man runs fast. Uh oh, they're on him. He is going to take a good chunk of damage and get brought down now. Although he did get a courier first, <laughs> and now Zinq, wait a minute. Uh, blast of the illuminate goes out. Flame break pushback onto two. It's not quite enough. Dead. Dy not able to do it, and Dy lived through it all. They're gonna oh, heal a little man. bit there too. Jeez, it's just. I mean, it's a little hard, but more than anything, it's laziness. Right. It requires a lot of effort. <laughs> yeah. I guess that is the definition of hard, though, I suppose. <laughs> Bottom. They're on to Ame. Nowhere to go. You talked about this. An easier time to move around the map on this coddle and finding kills. And now Zinq runs right into analog and well, maybe bites off more than you can chew. They are not going to go any further here, it looks like. Uh, yes, they are. XXS. Okay, never mind. He's dead. Decide to fight. XXS. Not where he thought that was going to go. And well, now Missile gets eaten up by the snowball, but Schofield's still living through this. The sniper's going to die enough. too. XM, he's in trouble. KJ right on top of him. The extra heal comes out. XM, he's really low. Is it going to be enough for the finish? It is. Analog walks away from Ame, trying to get out of the harm's way. And oh, denies. Oh. <laughs> Analog with the okay. deny. And Devi Lama will just be forced to onslaught off to the other side. But Ame chase down wasn't able to get that kill. Ancients pretty effectively. That's a three stack or a two stack rather right now on theirs. But 
these pickoffs. I mean, DY is caught again and he's reapplying. Dead. He's just gone. Although that's not going to be another charge. Wait a minute. Hold on. Okay. Never mind. XXS is just going to walk in and die. <laughs> so they lose two and they get a charge on Coddle. Peep, 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 peep here. This sort of can salvage things a bit. He's one. You see the coddle. He's oh, too fast. he's too fast. And now, and now he's bad. dead. <laughs> they drop it. Ulti out. Oh, man. So much damage on to XXS already. And the Bat Rider also in trouble. Primal moves forward. They take down one. They're going to get more kills, although that is going to be Rubik dead. Nice combination there, XXS. Okay, they got him. Ulti connects onto Analog enough for the finish. It is going to come at a lot of people's lives. And Hector did show up. All right, PL is in the play, and that is four dead for two. You got Coddle, but there's a bigger boy on campus. That works now, as they're now going to kill DY here. If they can manage... Oh, Coddle has no ult, so maybe... He's getting sticky palm. <laughs> Getting sticky to, to death. Yeah, that it's one a hurts. It's sad death. No such thing For DY. Man. Bottom. Bye. You could have Hector nearby. Not option to go yet. Yeah, they have Snowball onto one. Spear connects there. Ame, Snowball Dead. stolen by Rubik. Oh, man. And now they show up. Gonna find XXS. He is gonna die too. Heroa came in the clutch. 7,000 gold lead stuff happened, but he's farming just as quickly as the Sven. Actually, f faster than him. Nope. You're talking about bottom side. Arena down. Analog hit by the spear. And with Sniper showing up, that's enough for a finish. Good pick. That's a good pick, but at the same time, Ame might be oh, picking no. as well here. Yeah, no way out of this one. Uh -oh, okay. They're leaving the kill for Hector. Yes, so. By Lama didn't want to use hold. Bit of a taunt, I think. <laughs> from far as you can attack him. And that's going to be yeah. a problem there, too. And this is also a problem here, too. Solar bind. Not like this. No way out. <laughs> oh, man. Lassos to try and keep him alive. Not going to happen. And pulverizes out. Divai Lama punches. DY in the face. Another kill racked up by Heroic. Middle tower is under attack. And a buddy. Under attack. That's big. That is big. You, you, you lose random heroes like that, the game feels hopeless. And DY, who cares? But, Radiance you know. Middle tower Wait, what? Okay. <laughs> I thought he was lift. getting out for a second. Lift was literally one second on cooldown there. Uh, it was close. And BKB has been used Radiance on Primal? Tower is under attack. Not uh, easy. And you need some oh, mana no. an item. Thank this. you. No. He's AFK. Oh, Blink. Radiance top tower is under attack. Uh, uh, no. <laughs> this poor guy. On. Well, luckily, Midas being on cooldown doesn't matter anymore. Listen, I don't want to hear it. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, my God. The blink to dodge the stun. DY gets the lasso. Ame onto both of them. The save. Schofield gets a little bit of help from his buddies and then wants to walk away. There's nowhere to walk, though. He did have BKB TP out, but of course, Divai Lama was there with the pulverize. They will find and kill Ame as the end that we think is coming it just goes closer and closer. Is that something oh, they that's okay? The harm? Okay, cool. Like a new way to BM them, you know? Really oh, the recall. Somebody. Oh, no. Oh, oh, she called another person. Come recall. Skyro. Chase, chase. Skyro's next. I did this recall have zero. Dude, is he going to do it again? Do it again. Isn't that worth on to K1? Farm it up, get your hearts, and after the, oh, the, he went for the Lincolns. Oh, I'm out of there. And Schofield in some trouble. 
Okay, XG, they go for the wrong PL. He's able to juke him out. He thought it was the real one. He didn't know. It's not. Ame in trouble. Low HP gets pulled in. Not able to survive. As they had the halberd out after the fact, they take down the tusk. The PL illusion bait. Rarely seen, but much appreciated. And they call it. The missile is going to go. And eventually, they do call it. They 28 call it. minutes in. Oh, they mentally broke him. Oh, no. And, and then you tip after? Holy moly.